Now, if you think catching a pike could be a bit risky, then wait until you see the kind of fish Jeremy Wade tackles. He takes fishing to a whole different level and films his adventures for us to follow. His latest series starts tonight, right here on ITV1. And the fact that it is called River Monsters says all you need to know about the sort of pictures you can expect to see now, as Callum Watkinson reports. It's fishing, but not as we know it. In the third series of his hit show, West Country angler Jeremy Wade peers into some of the world's murkiest freshwater hidey holes and yanks out their often terrifying inhabitants. Each programme investigates a fisherman's tale, which on the surface of it sounds quite unlikely. Um, but then what I do is I, I delve behind the story, I, I talk to witnesses, put a line in the water and hopefully eventually something comes along and it's the beast behind the, the story. It's a fisherman's right to talk up the size of his catch, but Jeremy's travels have taught him that truth is often stranger than fiction. That was inside of the thigh. Everybody knows that fishermen tend to exaggerate and make things up, and so it's paring away at what is, what is made up and seeing if there's anything left by the time you've really examined it. And what surprises me is that very often there is something. As well as a gruelling shooting schedule which sees him crisscross the globe several times per series, Pulling these creatures from the water is not for the faint-hearted. This 20-stone stingray took him four hours to land. I might have to just kneel on top of the animal. Uh, There's the obvious danger from teeth and tails, okay. but sometimes it's the quiet ones. With certain creatures, you can see what you're dealing with. Some of the fish, though, you look at them and they don't look particularly dangerous. Uh, one of the programs coming up is about electric eels in the Amazon. I spoke to a young lad in the Amazon and he actually watched somebody in front of him die as a result of being shot by an electric eel. That is, it's doing a sort of, it looks like a muscle contraction, spasm almost. That's when it's actually shocking. River Monsters has already made Jeremy something of a household name in the States. With a fourth series due later this year, this is one angler whose tall tales have plenty to back them up. Callum Watkinson for The West Country Tonight.